Hi everyone, I am coming at you today with another review for Mishu. It's a company out of the UK and they have a lot of gel polishes, builder gels, they have an acrylic line. I will leave the link to their website in the description box, so please go check it out. I keep forgetting to tell you all, they have free worldwide shipping. Also, you'll see this code right about here and that is my discount code and if you use that on checkout you can get an additional 10% off your order so yay please take advantage of that this is a water globe mold and it's in the shape of a heart they have about four of these water globe molds and I think the biggest dome they have is 10 mm that's round you know and I think that's gonna be a little bit easier to work with and these sell for eight pound, which is 10 US dollars. And remember, free shipping. This is two pieces. This one is the heart shape and it's hollow in there. And then this one here, let me turn it to the side and you can see how that is having the heart hump up. This one here is the one we wanna fill with gel. What I'm gonna use to fill my mold is IBD Intense Seal. It is a no cleanse top coat. I've used it in the past on globes and it really works good. And with this mold being so small and so tiny, it's kind of difficult to get it cleaned out and everything. So I don't really want to have to deal with a tacky layer. Go ahead and fill the heart mold all the way in, all the way to the top. Take the other part and just put it on top and squish it down in there. And you can see that the gel is uh, running out over here. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hold it down because you don't wanna get like any bubbles down in the heart. See, you can see a bubble. You can see a bubble right there. You want that to be, you want that out of there. So you're gonna have to hold it. That won't be good if you have a bubble. There, if the bubble went right out. And I'm gonna hold this in the lamp. So I'm gonna hold this in the lamp for about 10 seconds and then I'm gonna let go of it and let it cure for the rest of the full minute. And here's the heart. There it is. If you look on the other side of the mold, it's gonna have like little bits of excess like this. Of course, that's what's squished out from around it and it's no good, so you just throw it out. You take your clippers and you're gonna clip around the heart, okay? And you can get it pretty good to where you don't need to file. Now it's time to add the glitter. I'm just gonna add just a little tiny bit of glitter. Now I'm gonna make the bottom, and it is what's gonna go on top of this heart here. Take the mold here, and I just flip it over to where there's a flat surface. I'm just going to add some of the IBD Intense Seal. Cure that for 30 seconds. Make sure that you get at least three thick coats because if you don't, if when you drill the hole, uh, it could crack on you. I'm gonna go ahead and cure this again. This now it's time to apply the bottom. And on the tile, I have some more IBD and I'm just gonna put it around the edge of the heart all the way around. I want the hole to be kind of in the center. Cure that to make sure it's sealed all the way around. I'm gonna go around it one more time, around the perimeter here, and then go ahead and cure that again. I flipped it over, and before I trim the excess off, I'm gonna go ahead and fill it. So I'm using water in a syringe, and these syringes, we can buy those at a drugstore for, depending on the size, anywhere from like 15 cents to a quarter. What I'm gonna plug the hole with is just regular builder gel. I'm gonna plug that hole up. Hear that. Just clean it a little bit. I'm gonna trim off the excess and file it. And if you see the little edges there, you can take your file and carefully file those away or just smooth them down so they're not real jagged looking. This is the final look. 
and I think it's kind of cute. I think these are a little bit small and I think they would go a little bit better on maybe shorter nails. I found it kind of, I don't know, like fiddly, you know, you're just kind of playing around with it. I dropped it a couple times, so it's, you know, it's pretty small. The uh, dome one that was like 10 mm might work better. I mean, you're able to make them pretty relatively easy. I just put some rhinestones around it kind of quickly, and I think if you put some color on the back of it, like maybe, I don't know, like blue or pink, you know, on the bottom of the heart. So yeah, I do like the molds. A little bit small, but I do like it. Thanks for watching. Bye.